it's it's going to be what is in my bag video um by the way i carry this uh, versace uh jeans so folk leather red folk leather um handbag this it's kind of medium size it's not too big it's not very small and uh, i really like it it's pretty heavy because i put tons of stuff inside this bag i really love i really love the pattern of it i really love the shiny leather i love the color and uh, this color for me works with every every single clothes which i have Okay, let's move on on this video because it's going to be super long if I don't stop to blah blah blah. Okay, this is the bag. Came with two pockets, big pockets in the side. One is here and one in the back. And two small packets in the sides but in this pocket i really don't store anything and i don't put anything in front because i really don't like the um, how looks on this bag because it's make it like big and more fat um and uh, i really like it this kind of slim uh very beautiful shape on it on the back side in this pocket I have it just my wallet. I lately got this wallet. This is by Chavignon and I really like it because it's sport sports uh, uh, wallet but I really like it because uh, you can put anything inside like my IDs, my credit cards and everything. Um, some chain right here in this pocket money inside here and i really like it and it's small it's not that heavy like my before and that is everything which i have on the sides nothing else and everything which i have is inside the bag uh goes with this very beautiful zipper golden zipper with this chain which says versace jeans you can open that and you go with all the products which I have it inside. Came with two, uh, three pockets, one pocket with the zipper and on this side we have a smaller four, a phone case and something a little bit bigger. First pocket I have this Nivea Vitamin Shake Cranberry Raspberry Lip Balm. I really love this one. In this pocket also I got the Airways um, Extreme gums uh, in this in the same pocket i have my keys I, in the second pocket i carry my phone now in this other pocket with the zipper which is here i have oh my god this is going to be super long video this is lady gaga viva glam lady gaga by mac uh, looks like that also i have it a little bit darker shade on top of it because I put a lip liner before that and uh, Viva Glam uh, Lady Gaga number two but I keep in the box because I really don't want to mess up my bag this nude lip gloss and the third product which I have is this Skin Denivia Makeup Finishing Spray the little box which came with my set I got the set if you wanted to uh, see a review for these products let me know in the comments down below definitely I will gonna do okay. that is everything which I have in my pocket with the zipper next go with the everything else first I have my sunglasses which here is super super cold and we don't have Sun but sometimes it's going to a little bit shiny and this is by mango and i really love with the pearls and everything i really love these sunglasses it's big it's huge this um, moonlight jasmine exotic fragrance mist by victoria's secret i love this smell i really really love smell like jasmine but very exotic just have a little bit scent of vanilla that sweetness but is feminine very rich smell i really love this one 
and my gloves leather it's full leather it's not real back it's pretty clean pretty organized I don't put everything inside yeah first is this by real techniques I get the sets but came with this kind of brush holders and I really like it especially if I need to put in the bag because it's slim it's um, um, necessary pocket you don't need to put too much br uh, brushes inside and I have it these brushes this is the brushes which I carry with me because if I need touch up this is uh, enough for me I usually don't touch up my makeup because it's not necessary with this product with Scandinavia makeup finishing spray but sometimes I need a little bit touch up and if I go somewhere after work I need a little bit, yeah, oomph to my face. First, I have this big, large powder Sigma brush F30. I love for powder. I will gonna show you the powder powder which I use. This is my favorite all the time favorite uh, foundation brush. It's Real Techniques brush buffer brush. I really love this makes the skin super super gorgeous foundation applies perfectly next for my highlight because i want a very very kind of a shiny highlight it's a sigma large contour brush f40 which is angle brush and this brush i use just for a blush and next is this angle brush by artist b86 brush by sigma which i'm using for my concealer and that is this bag i use this makeup bag it's not big deal the bag it's kind of yeah but i like it because it's small keeps all my makeup secure inside this is waterproof if something is spilled inside the bag it's not going to go all over my handbag and I really like it and I'm gonna go continue with that just to show you this is the empty bag it's super clean because I'm like I said super organized when it's um, this kind of products especially with expensive bags like this I really don't want to ruin the bag yeah the bags go in the side and let's move on for the makeup I know that it's super long yeah let's move on uh, this is the bag which I have everything which I need I know that is super super too much but sometimes I really need makeup sometimes I don't even open this this um, case uh, this is Garnier BB cream for oily skin I have dry skin but I use this one I prefer this one by the original one because this stay perfectly on the skin I have it right now mix it with something else I'm gonna show you with what uh, this is light in light works perfectly looks like your skin stay all day long and have a little bit more uh, coverage than the other one mix I'm mixing that with MAC face and body foundation I really need to kind of put this a little bit in the smaller box to carry on with me because this is a huge box bottle and it's kind of very very keep the space limited in the box uh, in the case but yeah I love this this is in shade N3 which is a little bit darker right now for me but because of this is a little bit lighter I mix together and works perfectly for every day and uh, gives a very flawless uh, coverage beautiful coverage but very natural skin looking next is my powder this is Maybelline Affinity Tone powder this is the same product like 24 hours by Maybelline uh, but it's in the different box um, for the um, I think for the Europe yeah I'm in the shade number three light sand beige okay next what I'm having here it's two concealers I'm so so into the concealers and before I can use it this I don't use this before because creases in my lines goes everywhere but like I said with my skin Nivea spray it's first time in my life to use this 
and this is Max Select cover up in NW15. NW15. It's a lighter and gives very, very beautiful highlight, a very bright uh, under eyes. And all the time, my favorite. I know that I keep saying this is all the time, but it's all the time favorite. 51 Light Radiance in Borgia Healthy Mix Concealer. All the time favorite, my holy grail. Uh, and one highlight, this is a Beauty MAC powder in Snow Globe. This came in, I think, winter collection, yeah. Uh, last year or oh, no? I don't know. Yeah, I'm not very good in uh, collections. And it's a beigey but very beautiful, glowy, natural look. One blush. This is by Slick Makeup Blush and it's a Life's Atha Peach. It's a super bright orange, but you don't see that it's super orange, yeah? Uh, because if you use a little bit, it's going to work awesome. Love this one. Oh my god. Okay, the brow set, this is Essence Wildcraft. I really love Essence brow set, especially the brown one. It's perfect for um, and the brow, my brows, because I want a little bit more uh, darker. Okay, next is this Lip Balm by Fruitini Milk Orange. Oh my god, this smells like oranges, like really milk with orange makes this the lips uh, super super soft you want to eat this i really really want to lick my lips because this i love everything from fruitini it's so fruity so moisturizing i love okay next is this dr tollich uh this is cream for uh dark spo spots for pigmentation and for freckles I using this before apply anything on my face and I start to uh, to see that some uh, spots and uh, some dark pigmentation is kind of disappearing from my face after two weeks which is insane I never find something which works like this this is by Serbia I really don't know where you can find this uh, next is uh, one mascara. This is White Bar One Volume Express Maybelline mascara. Mascara. This is my favorite uh, mascara. Looks amazing. My lashes with this. I really love this one. Uh, Touch chocolate. I really don't know why is this on my back. I think before two days I was using this, and because of that, it's here. But in number two, yeah. Uh, one eyeshadow by MAC, this is uh, Chamomile, I love this, especially if I need a little bit touch up on my highlights, and uh, yeah, and sometimes I use this under eyes to kind of bright. One is Blinkity Amplified Lipstick by MAC, this is my favorite nude lipstick because I'm not very nude, 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 I want a little bit nude with the same, some color. It's by Rimmel London, which this is my favorite lipsticks this season, uh, especially this few months. One is this, which is Oxford Fuchsia. And, oh my god, this is the greatest lipstick ever. It's perfect pink lipstick goes smooth but very pigmented i really love more pigmented and yeah this is oh my god and the next one is rimmel kate moss the collection this is i think the newer collection i really don't know this is 102 no name and looks like this this baby it's a little bit drier for for formula but Oh my god, it's kind of the similar but more rich and more like coral. This is more pink, more blue tone, this is warm tone. But it's more pigmented, more um, stay power, it's awesome and yeah, pink. I know that's super long video and uh, thanks for watching and if you wanted to see a review for some products which I show in this video, uh, comment down below, like and thanks for subscribing and see you in the next video. See ya!